11 melee damage. Wow, this, this this one's stronger than the last one I had. The last one I had only did 10. Right, uh, then I shall keep the spear and uh, keep this axe off my heart bar. I wish we, wait, where's our merchant? Press him. He might Scroll not be there yet. Last time he I saw him. He is in, in the living room tree. Yeah, that's where I last saw him. <laughs> Why do all of the enemies. Why do they. Every single Terraria game I've played since they've added those stupid things, all the NPCs spawn in the Lippingwood Cave, and the only way that they'll move to the house is if, if, is if everybody is away from the house at once for like a second at a time, and then eventually they'll all teleport over to the house. Also, with that housing thing that I told you guys about, yeah. you can change if like a, a person, like somebody you don't want to join to be living in X house or another does happen to jo uh, move into a house that you don't want them to be in. You can change which house they go into be oh, with no. that, Play. which is a, a useful thing that you couldn't do before they added that. I remember multiple times, you know, my house that I built for like a merchant or something being taken up by some random NPC that I didn't need. <laughs> like, oh fuck, stop. <laughs> Pretty thing I found underground. What are you? Lester Healing Potion. Oh, it's just. I have 21 of those, dude. I just didn't know what it was. What, what happened to Bradley? Uh, he's over here by me. You have the spear. What do you mean, Charlie? What about it? Yeah, I, I, I know it comes out in the crimson. Oh, it's just a crawler. Oh, Don't worry. Why are you scared? Why are you scared of the spider? I'm more scared of these slimes than the spiders. But I'm scared of slimes for good reasons. I tend to die by them more. Don't understand why. I just do. Um, you guys might want to keep a campfire near you just for the hell of being able to, you know, oh. say I have a campfire if somebody needs it. It's yeah. good for health. We it's good for health region. I know. I I had left the campfire at home. I I accidentally built a campfire and I just realized that that's actually a decently good idea to keep with me. Why are you blocking that off, Bradley? Don't block that off. I'm going <coughs> up there. Unblock that, Bradley. I'm going up there. Oh my God, Bradley, you cannot run away from every mob, or you will literally never get better at any game ever. Poke it with your poking stick. Right, you right. do have a stick specifically designed to poke things to death. Use it. All right. And Bradley says that he's going to be our melee character. If he's going to be a decent melee character, if you ha if you happen to be digging underground and you find any life crystals, those are for him. You use a hammer to break those. Oh God! But we can't. Oh. Oh yeah. It's okay. Right here. Okay. Yeah, uh, bro, I guess you can do that. Special there are some special rain time mobs that show up when it does start raining. Like yeah, flying currently fish. we're currently we're in the crimson. I'm collecting shade wood. Yeah, flying fish. They happen. It's yeah. a, a a real thing that's very strange. Yeah, there's one above us. Bradley, I will go ahead and say that. They're not that. They're not difficult. None of the rain time mobs are much more. Di they are slightly more difficult than your average daytime mobs, but simply because it's raining. So you can get some pretty cool. Uh, yeah, you can get costumes. some pretty nice things with it. You can get costumes. I know. Like a rain suit. Birdie die. Fucking Wait, no. Fish. What was that? What was that scene from uh, like episode four of Ruby? Birdie, no. <laughs> yeah, I remember that. <laughs> I, I enjoy, wasn't that the giant bird fight? 
Yeah, uh, that was the same scene. That was the same. I think may, either the episode before, or a couple episodes before, or the same episode as the Nevermore fight. But <laughs> Ruby was like falling out of the sky from being launched on those platforms, and she hits like a raven. No, no, it was like it was one or two episodes after that. But the John Bird no, fight it was, was, it was my before. Favorite. It was definitely before the Nevermore fight. Definitely yeah. before. Yeah. And she's falling out of the sky after they get launched into the forest, and she hits a bird. Like Bradley, I love how you abandoned me. Yeah, if you have a partner, stick with them. Yeah, you really need to watch Ruby. It's like the best show on the internet. It's amazing. Also, volume two in like a few days. I know. Less I can't wait two for weeks. it. Less than two weeks. I'm. I'm like this is my hype right hey, now. Look, I'm more excited for. I'm more excited here. for Ruby volume two than I am about going to Hawaii going to Hawaii without me? Without any of you people. I feel loved. Thanks, God. <laughs> hey, look, if you want to pay for it, hey. <laughs> I'm not paying for your going to Hawaii. Actually, what's funny is I tried to get my dad to go, would to take us to Hawaii this year. He wouldn't do it. He wanted to go on a cruise to Mexico again. I'm like, why would you want to go to Mexico? All they have there is cheap beer and AIDS. <laughs> not all. They have tequila. Yeah, they they also they have I that, and then they also I have. Really have no interest in enjoying tequila. Yeah, they 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 also have that, and then they also have people who think they can they can put up sheetrock properly, but they don't. As my dad recently find found out, building his new office like an idiot. Nice job, Bradley. A swarm of face uh, monsters. Like I am incredibly undergeared. For 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 the crimson, and I'm almost halfway through the crimson. I'm going into a cave into the crimson, so I all feel of nice. the monsters that you guys failed to kill just decided to come say hi to me. I didn't fail to kill any monsters so far. Oh, never mind. I ca I can't really say that. No, no, get, get away! Oh God, two. That's the problem with the Crimson, is because you end up in a situation where it's like, Oh yeah, I got this. Oh god, another one. Well, I'm, I was trapped in a cave, so, but... I don't think I want to go farther into that cave until I'm really ready. Probably really shouldn't. If it's like a cave with teeth in it, that's a, that's like a special Crimson cave yeah. that you... Yeah, that's you what go I was in. To fight. You go in there to fight the second boss. Oh. Um, Bradley, do you have any normal wood on you? What kind of anvil do we have? Uh, we have a lead anvil. Lead is the replacement for iron. Some level, I mean, like it's just it's just to add more variety. Sometimes I can't even buy the. Uh, anvil. Use a vertebrae to craft a bloody spine, which you can use to forcibly summon the secondary boss. I think it's I think it's the secondary boss. There's both the eye of Cthulhu and the brain of Cthulhu. The brain, the eye of Cthulhu is technically the second boss if you count the king slime but the king slime can only spawn on the outer quarter outer either outer quarter or outer third of the map and he's so easy i wouldn't even really call him a boss but uh, the eye of cthulhu is technically the first boss and then the brain of cthulhu is the second eater of worlds and Bradley. then ain't i supposed to have those shooting stars if they're in a chest it's fine Guess that is true. Just don't take them out in the middle of the day. Please leave them. No, just put just put them all in this chest, okay? All shooting stars in, in the chest. I got stuck in a I swear, I thought Did that said Just bother. try to throw them, Bradley. You idiot. I already warned you people about that. Bradley. You can't hand in this game. You toss it out. You toss it out of your inventory. There's no game on the planet. This does not have a trading system. Okay, we got, uh... We just lost, some... like, 12... We lost two mana crystals worth of stars because Bradley doesn't listen. We now have an angler ready to be settled in. And a flying fish that's harassing me. Okay, yeah, good. Rage why'd you, quit. You, Bradley, just Bradley. because you won't listen to me is no reason for you to rage quit. That he is right. I went through the process of explaining this a long time ago. Oh, 
Why? Why did the flying fish <laughs> get away? You're so annoying. I love how fast I could I could just place doors. <laughs> I was like <laughs> placing doors, down walls. An Bradley, tossing and throwing is the only way you can give in a game like this. What's the difference between a furnace and a... Never mind, that is a furnace. It's supposed to say in a fireplace. Which led... Uh, I'm gonna... No, I'm not. I'm gonna dig down is what I'm gonna do. <clears throat> Somebody wants to come help me dig. They have about... I'd say a minute before the fall gets too long before they can jump down here without worry. Bradley, rejoin the red team since you rage quit the server. Yeah, you do have to rejoin the team, sadly. Thank you. I'm gonna keep building these houses for more people to come for me to loot and rob and torture. You don't do any of that. They sell you stuff. They give you items. Shh. That's so, what in fact, one happen. of them, one of them is, one of them is quite useful to me specifically. The uh... can a bookshelf count as a table? No. Oh. Why the hell would you use a bookshelf as a table? I don't know, but I have a bookshelf, not a table. Those, the bookshelf is used to make a, um, to make the hard mode spells. Hmm. Okay. Happy I picked that up then. Stop, 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 no! Stop! I mean, just place it down somewhere in the house, just as long as we have access to it and we don't lose it. I need a table as well, thank you. Actually, I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and place that bookshelf too. I'm sorry, my computer sounds like a leaf blower. I can't hear it. I can. That's what I think of whenever I hear whenever I hear sorry my, my computer sounds like a leaf blower. <laughs> Thank you. It's, uh, it sounds pretty similar to that. So we have three houses. I don't can we just kill the guide? Please. No, you need a guide voodoo doll. Yeah, that that's what I mean. <laughs> you, do you want to go to hell and fight demons to get a guide voodoo doll and risk it dropping in the lava and summoning the wall of flesh? Yes. No, you don't. Dark the wall of flesh right. will will actually eat you. It does have several mouths to eat you with. I know. I've seen the wall of flesh. So now we have a die trader. Oh, uh, me and Ethan have a record time of killing the wall of flesh in less than I think it was like I think it was like forty something seconds. We killed the wall of flesh. You should you should see the ethos record like literally it didn't even get a foot before it died but they they were like way overpowered remember, whenever they did it yeah though. I bet they were hard mode well me and Ethan were hard mode geared but there were only there was there was only two of us there was only two of them but yeah they, 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 they were hard mode geared they had this like they had this spear that had something to do with mushrooms and it was I have nice. I have had that it's a pretty it's a pretty useful weapon but it's not not anywhere close to the best in hard mode some one of the best weapons you can get in hard mode is uh, something like the scourge of the corruptor or something, and you you swing it, and it's considered a melee weapon. And you swing it, you launch a little ball of it's not corruption, but it looks like the same thing that the corruptors launch. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. I've seen it. And it it like releases five little corruptors that go and kill stuff. And it is horrifyingly overpowered. So let me now. I found place. a cave, guys. I just dug straight down until I found a cave, which is, you know, exactly what I wanted to not do. Don't I have a chair? I don't have a chair. I didn't make a chair. I feel very accomplished now. I forgot to make a chair. Could... At least you only forgot the chair. Me and Ethan, for a long time, we sat around staring at a room, wondering why the hell it wasn't acceptable housing, and eventually we figured <laughs> out there wasn't any walls. What I should do? Yeah, definitely doing it. I now have a I have a deadly shade wood bow. Wow. I have a lead bow. 
because I yeah. also have um, a shade wood hammer why hammers are not combat effective <laughs> it's just to use pretty soon we're gonna be getting to metals that will outstrip your shade wood I know. Ooh, a boreal sword a what a boreal wood sword a what a boreal wood sword I don't know what that is it's made from that um made from the wood in the frost biome the tundra uh, okay a sword made of that stuff. It looks pretty nice. Is it? Is it any good though? Um, it looked decent. Uh, hold on. Let Let me compare it to uh making a new shade wood sword and not making a new shade wood sword. <laughs> so shade wood sword, if it would stop scrolling. And a zombie just jumped down my hole. I'm gonna die. I did. I, uh, apparently, I made armor uh, and did not know. When? <laughs> Well, just now. Did not did not know is kind of the operative phrase there. A zombie just this is why I hate strip mining in this game because sometimes zombies will just jump down your hole and rip your face to shreds. Why did you do that? I did not mean to do that. I'm I'm over here clicking crap trying to fix things. Want this? I guess I'm going to equip boots. Shade wood boots. Why not? Now, shade wood sword which. That the shade wood sword by default does ten melee damage. Everyone does six, so shade wood's better. Actually, that does less damage than just your basic wooden sword, which gives seven melee damage. That is Where true, is actually. Wow. <laughs> How did you get in here, kind eyeball, sir? Wait, did our did our painter did one of our guys die? No, they just probably haven't shown up yet. No, because there was someone else in here. Oh, great. I don't really care. Oh, no. I'm just glad the merchant's safe. The problem being that, oh, oh, we haven't uh, anti-blood wound this house, have we? All right, give me like two secs here. We now have a painter. We have a dye seller and a painter. Wow. That's dandy. We don't have anyone useful in living here. Oh God, I fell. We have a merchant. Merchant is one of the most useful NPCs in the game true but he's not selling anything I won't he's rarely selling anything you would want hey you know those walls you have yeah place some walls right there inside that little space um past the area I got one wall. I'll make more or do you already have it no I'm I'm anti blood mooning this place. Anti blood mooning? How's that? The blood moon allows zombies to break down doors, but they can't break down, break open doors if there are two doors in place. No, no, no. Bring it back. Bring it back. Back inside the house. God, that's fast. Then place it in between the doors. Like, it, just an extension of the walls that are already inside the house. I first need the doors to actually open. Meaning, I need to. Hey, Bradley found a light source. Found the what? He found a light source. He found a chandelier. They look pretty. <laughs> there. It's in the house. Is that as far, is that as far in as you can get them? Yes. Can you not place it behind the doorway? So behind the door itself. Well, no, I already placed it up too, and just a little bit. Behind the door. What about the other side. All right. So always leave the inside door open. <laughs> that, that way we don't have to go through. We don't have to jump through hoops to get into the house. I can't open this door. <laughs> oh, now I can. Get you no. Know, obviously, this is. Go and fix this then. <laughs> so I don't. Hold on. I just got a wooden wall. Sir, open, 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 open the. Fuck, open. If 
opens the way you are facing. A keg. That's the you only place that lets me target, so. Oh my god. Hand me some of those balls. Just, just three. That's all I need. And break down those, because I don't have a hammer. Oh. Here, let me just use my shade wood hammer. It takes crap out in one swing. What the? the never mind. I'm just gonna stop questioning stuff. All right, don't open. Leave, like I said, leave the inside door open. <clears throat> this way, zombies can't break into the house during a blood moon. When do we? Get and a believe moon? me, there will be random. It could have been the first night we could have had a blood moon. I've actually seen that happen before. And I was watching Etho. They were on a new world blood moon right away. But they had blood moons every other night. It seemed like. No, they're not. They shouldn't be that common. Now there are some. There are some. Wait, is it blood? Yeah, it's blood moon. There are some pretty dangerous new ones that that happen in hard mode. That whose name, proper name, I can't remember for the life of me, but. Ooh, wow, they're scary. Hey, do you want to come? There. You want to come mining with me? That's a that's a boss, and you have to actually spawn that. You want to come mining with me? Um, is mining right here safe? Yeah. You get the left block. I'll get the right block. Okay. Hurry up. Okay, wait for Bradley because you know Bradley, you're six hundred feet down to the earth. Not happening. Just leave your mouse in the same spot and hold left click. Periodically, I'll place down a torch or something. I'm not going to wait for you to kill yourself. In fact, if you kill yourself, you're just wasting money. We're already really Can't far down, so don't worry about it. Dun, dun, dun. I hope you wrote a bunch of, um... A bunch of light sources? Yeah. No, I, I hope... Well, I have, like, 15 torches, but I hope you brought a bunch of platforms. Uh, but I have a ton of wood. Is this stone over here? Yeah, there's just stone. It'll sparkle if it's in one. Okay, yeah, there's stone. You can jump down in here, down here if you want, but I honestly think you'll die if you're not careful, Bradley. It looks as though Bradley is preparing to jump down the hole. Wait, right. rain? You're talking about rain or what? Well, so we'll be able to tell if Bradley jumps down here. His number, oh, he's gonna die. <laughs> well, Bradley, we now know that you are not a bouncy substance. He he's a little too solid for that. I. W if you didn't think there was fall damage in this game, you're a little bit dense. Why? Because you were 600 feet underground and we're impatient just like you are? <laughs> I think this video is more of you talking to Bradley. <clears throat> Do I need to shut up? No. It's entertaining, no, please. Oh, yeah, kill her. You can get some cool stuff out of it, especially if it's a zombie. Snow White's up there, but what if I want to meet my childhood princess? Oh, I bet it's Llewellyn. Um, I don't think we have a spare room for her. Uh, it's a traveling merchant. She'll pass through and then leave Never mind. And pass through again. They bring random stuff. I don't like I, I, I apparent I'm just assuming here I honestly never met one because they're ooh lead see lead ores sparkle in the light uh, I don't know if that's a con if that's a thing that's been in it since the beginning but it's a very useful little trait that ores have that they sparkle bright inside of the light fun how far are we gonna go uh until either one of us dies or we hit a cave and start exploring oh look a cave look. <laughs> wait what Wee. what stuff what stuff is she selling brother if 
If it's a bunch of aesthetic stuff, then I wouldn't really say it's good stuff, but... I found platinum. Uh, our platinum, that's, that's useful, but it's not the next tier, it's not the next tier up. <laughs> Actually, there's no point in checking to see if this thing is aligned with itself, because we're not going to be coming back down here after we die. Well, why not use platforms? I, I only have like 112 wood, we've gone far more than 112 blocks, I'm skipping that cop run. What is this? Good luck, Bradley. Hey, look, it's aligned with itself. <laughs> there it is. You know what else I noticed? There's more platinum up here, I think. Also, you know what else Brad, I noticed? every time you die, you lose a little bit of money. I really you know what else I noticed? Time for another clip. 